Hey everybody! Welcome to Rachel's Room, where every Thursday I answer your questions. I'm gonna answer them now because that's what we do on this thing. What was the last book you read? Was it good? Share with us! This was the last book I read. I read it on the flight home from Playlist. It is Glozell Green's, wait, let me tell you, Inspirational Poems by Glozell Green. I liked it. It's a good book. Another book I'm trying to read at the moment is this one. And I read it to put me to sleep because this is the most boring book I've ever read in my entire life. So when I want to go to sleep, I read this. I've been trying to read more because it makes you smarter or something. I don't know. People have more respect for people that read books instead of watch TV shows. People are impressed by how much TV I watch. It's really weird. Colleen can sing. Do you have any talents? No, I have zero talents. I can't do anything. I'm talentless. Thanks for asking. What was your favorite part of the Miley Cyrus concert? This part? And 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 this part? This concert was the most epic concert I think to ever exist. It is phenomenal. I loved it so much. She came out, coming out of her own mouth. There was a giant screen of her and she slid down her own tongue. That's how she started the concert. She ended the concert going out on a giant wiener. Every single part of the concert was just amazing and mind-blowing and phenomenal and I loved it. She genuinely looked like she was having fun on stage. Like she was actually having fun and laughing and smiling. You could tell it was genuine. It wasn't just like, oh, gotta do this now, gotta do this now. She was gonna do whatever she wanted and she didn't care because it was her party and she was having fun with it. I loved it so much. Which nostril do you pick first? I pick the one with the booger in it first. Do you always smile for pictures? No. <laughs> Recently, since I started doing YouTube and taking pictures with viewers, I've noticed that my thing is doing this. I smile with my mouth open and I don't know why I do it, but I do. So this is how I smile for most pictures. When I smile, I lose my eyes. So like, they, and you can I just, they go away. So if I do this, I, my eyes can still stay open and you can see me and it's better. I don't know. Do you sing in the car? Yes. I sing my heart out in the car. If I'm in a car, there will be music blaring and I will be singing it at the top of my lungs. And if someone in a car next to me catches me singing, I will sing to them and I will have a full on concert for that person. I love singing in the car. I don't get embarrassed by it at all. Some people, you know, don't want people to laugh at them. It, but in my opinion, I'm giving them joy for the day. And I'm giving myself joy by singing at the top of my lungs. Have you sneezed and farted at the same time? I've never sneezed and farted at the same time. I've burped and farted at the same time, but I feel like sneezing and farting at the same time would be a very pleasurable experience and I want to try that. Is there a hickey on your shoulder? Alright, here on my shoulder is a birthmark and most people think that it is a hickey. This is a birthmark. If you look at any video with me in a tank top, that will be there. I am not getting a hickey daily by someone on the shoulder. No, it is a birthmark. I have a birthmark on my shoulder. But almost every single time I wear a tank top, there is someone that asks me if I got a hickey on my shoulder. People, I did not have someone suck on my shoulder. Because that's weird. Who is most competitive, you or Colleen? Colleen is way more competitive than me, and that's why she is not allowed to do sports or board games. Because if she loses, oh man, she gets angry. I'm a competitive person, I want to win. But growing up, I was always on really bad sports teams that always lost. So when I lose, I'm like, hey, you know, that happens, clearly. But yeah, Colleen gets very angry if she loses. Very, very angry. Alright, comment below, leave your questions for next week's Rachel's Room, and subscribe to see Rachel's Room every Thursday and what pisses me off every Tuesday. And remember guys, stay awesome, possums.